Dylan Black. This is going to be a lot of fun. It's a very classy bingo for two great causes. Let's say hello right now to uh, Denis Schreibert uh, with us, uh, Elder Care Foundation of Ottawa. Hello, Denis. Hi. We also have Sharon Carstairs with us, the Elder Care Foundation. Welcome back to the program. Thank you. Delighted to, have you to here. be here. You're lo you look like you're ready to play a, a mean game of bingo. <laughs> I am. Am I correct? Good. Okay. <laughs> two great organizations. Uh, Denis, let's start with the Elder Care Foundation of Ottawa. Tell us a bit about yourself. So the Elder Care Foundation was uh, created by our founder and president, Adam Naimi. Uh, so his uh, grandmother, seeing his grandmother going through uh, long-term care uh, facilities, uh, seeing the conditions and sometimes the treatments some of the people were getting, uh, he wanted to do something. And so he created the, fa the, the foundation. And what we do is we provide uh, support to seniors living in not-for-profit long-term care mm. uh, homes. Okay. Here in Ottawa, there's 13 of them. Okay, and uh, Sharon, I mean, uh, pretty relatable or related, uh, the OutCare Foundation, tell us a bit about it. Well, the OutCare Foundation provides care for palliative patients uh, in uh, the LIN, the whole uh, regional hospital unit. Okay. Um, we prepare uh, for people living within their home and people in hospice and we provide a lot of equipment needs, but we also provide funds to train volunteers mm -hmm. who work both in the hospices and in homes okay. caring for patients. So I heard that word funds. You need funds. Two great organizations that are perhaps overlooked a little bit. So Denis, well, let's get into the details of the black tie bingo, okay? So this is a lot of fun and it's, it's, so it's five years now this has been taking place? This is our fifth year and uh, so far we've raised just under $250,000. Wow. Which is great wow. uh, for both organizations which are, uh, for, for example, uh, Elder Care Foundation is uh, critically, uh, sorry, long-term care as uh, not-for-profit is really underfunded, mm -hmm. critically underfunded. So these funds come in very handy for, for both our organizations. Yeah, that's great. So then would you like to give me some details, Sharon, on that's where the funds go? That's great, but this sounds like a fun time. It's a black tie bingo. Well, it is indeed. Yeah. Everybody dresses up in black tie or business suit and in fancy dress yeah. and arrives yeah. to a reception where they will have a variety of silent auction items to bid on. They will then uh, have uh, some libation, move into the <laughs> dinner, have a wonderful dinner, and then they'll start playing bingo for incredible prizes. Okay, so, so we see some of the, uh, the amazing pictures from uh, Black Tie Bingos of past. And now this is taking place at the Ottawa Conference and Event Centre, 200 Coventry Road. Now, what is the, the price to get into this fancy night? $150. Okay. And... Uh, the lottery rules do not allow that to be tax deductible, okay. so it is $150, <laughs> but you could win uh, a uh, $10,000 prize uh, to wow. go to Barbados, for example, to the uh, 13 if you add the airfare yes, uh, on top of it. Okay. Uh, or you could win a $750 uh, trip to Saint Laurent or everything in between. My gosh. My, uh, my favorite for this year is dinner for 10 at Signatures, the Cardon Bleu restaurant, complete with wines. You don't get that at normal bingo halls. You don't I mean. indeed, and I want to win that prize. <laughs> <laughs> so, Denis, I mean, there's, we'll some, for it. Yeah, there's some, some staggering statistics here that I have in the year 2041 about one in four Canadians will be over the age 65 and over that's correct and as I mentioned earlier uh, long-term uh, uh, long-term care is critically underfunded and uh, wait times which usually should be about three months which again is pretty high are now uh, will be expected to be around nine to ten months uh, hmm. to for placement oh gosh uh, you brought something special with you as well so this we is a did fancy pillow so this is our fancy cushion so what we're doing uh, although we also have we have the bing the bingo uh, and the sign auction I items what we do is we have a little bit of a side donation to raise money to for these super for these uh, cushions mm -hmm. uh, I know Sharon knows a bit more about well, them. Uh, yeah, I mean, they're wonderfully comfort cushions, and we yeah. call it our comfort campaign as a result. That's right. And these are both for palliative care patients and for patients who are living in long-term care mm -hmm. to make, quite frankly, their sitting much more comfortable. Hmm. And there are lots of us who attend, like me, uh, who don't want to buy silent auction items, but we're prepared to add extra money. Okay. To right. this. And I, I had a friend who recently passed away from uh, lung cancer, and... Uh, was given access to a similar pillow just in the last week. She was in the hospital for three to four months, and she only had access to a similar pillow in the last week. Had she get, had received it the last two or three months, a lot more uh, yeah. comfort yeah. would have been given to amazing. me. So amazing very important. Cause, ama two amazing causes. One great night, black tie bingo, and it's happening November 17th. Thank you very much. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. Have a good day.